I can truthfully say I've seen healthcare change radically. And what bothers me most is that I see all these young people coming into healthcare and not really having a chance to really see healthcare the way I used to see healthcare. And they, there's no time to really take care of patients anymore. There's no time to really sit down and do what you were trained to be doing. I think the spike is of the utmost importance because in surgery as well as other areas, we do see a big turnover rate with our staff. And it's hard to, you know, look at bringing in new staff and spending several months training them to do, you know, a, a difficult job and then watch them walk away and we're in the same position where we have to start all over again. With all the turnovers, it you're always having to train and plus the you know, jobs are not filled quickly. So you're down because uh, they haven't rehired person within that 30 days, then you have uh, to make up for it and work a little bit faster. My problem is, is I don't feel like I'm doing the care that I have done years ago because I'm getting too many patients and I can't attend that satisfaction that I would like to give them. And one of the reasons we don't have adequate staff is because our benefit plan is inadequate as well as our wages being some of the lowest in the city. This year I had to get a physical because it's required and it, it cleaned me out of my seat. This last year uh, was the first year I've been benefited and I paid out at least 8000 if not more dollars for my premiums, my, my co-pays, for my labs and x-rays, and, uh, and medication. To invest in us is to be investing in the patients as well. I love my job, I love my patients, but the reason for this fight is I want to feel appreciated. I'm worth more.